Yeah, we're getting closer to the Pilgrimage Festival. It's coming next month. And today in Nashville is giving one of our viewers a VIP prize package. Take a look at what you can win. An autographed Pilgrimage guitar from Gibson Gibbs. We'll show you that in just a little bit. It's really, really cool. In fact, you see it on our stage when our musical performances are playing. The winner will also get two VIP passes to Pilgrimage Music and Cultural Festival. You got to enter to win though. WSM mv.com slash contest. Now the contest runs until September the 15th. Good luck. Parking day. Parking day. I love parking day. We've been doing it here in Nashville since 2012 and yeah it's the best day of the year. So parking day. What is Parking Day? It happens all around our sweet city. It's brought by Civic Design Center, repurposing street parking places into parks. So let's learn more about it. We've got Veronica Foster here with Civic Design Center. Good to see you. Hi. How's okay, it going? so Parking Day, tell us more. Yes, absolutely. So Parking Day started as a global advocacy tool to really um, bring to light the fact that parking takes up so much of our public space and we could be using that public space for people so why not have one day where we can put, fill the meter um, <laughs> proverbial meter uh, and uh, showcase pop-up parklets for just one day and so we've been doing this since 2012 it started in San Francisco and we are so excited it's a really fun opportunity to showcase designers in town and really get people excited about parks. Yeah, and kind of adds a little bit of green space where maybe there wouldn't have been, right? Definitely um, not. Seeing it in front <laughs> of our spaces. Okay, so you have a special one this year. Where's yes. it gonna be? So it's actually gonna be in front of Wilburn Street Tavern. We're only doing one uh, parklet this year. And this is because over the last 10 years, we've been advocating for parklets. And now it's actually permanent legislation that people can uh, get a parklet permit and host a parklet in front of their business for the community. Um, maybe they have just benches for people to sit at. Maybe it's an opportunity for them to expand their business space. And so we really wanna advocate for local businesses to have parklets in front of their, their space. So that's why we're, we're running this competition to really try to advocate for people to um, have the opportunity to have this in front of their business. Also really beautifies the space outside. We saw a shot of the Wilburn exactly. Tavern, which is a lovely place, I'm sure, but it is really going to look like a very different space starting tomorrow. Starting tomorrow, what's going to happen outside of here? Yeah, so we actually, because we ran this design competition with designers, we voted on this amazing new parklet to be built by Hoare Construction. Um, we're partnering with NDOT to really advocate for this permit process to go through quickly. Uh, we want to be a liaison for these, these businesses. So Hoare Construction... Wait, am I hearing that right? Are you still waiting for the permits? <laughs> I was like, oh no, that no, could no, be no. a really long time. Well, luckily, um, the National Department of Transportation is going to be a great partner for us, and they're helping expedite this process I for love, the first parklet. I love this optimism. You hear yeah. us, <laughs> Department of Transportation. We need this sped up because it's going to be fall, y'all, and you need to be outside that Wilbur Tavern. Exactly. Well, they are a part of the process for us. It's uh, going to be great because we are um, we're trying to go through it with them so that we know and we can evaluate how the parklet, parklet prom process can go for small businesses and how we can encourage them to maybe adjust some things so it can be better in the future. Okay, there's going to be a block party happening, so this better get done pretty soon. I yeah. hope these things happen because it's September 17th. What's happening there as we give information on the stream? Yeah, so it's going to be really fun since parking day is typically, you know, dozens of parklets in one place. We've had it in Lower Broadway, 2nd Avenue. Now we're trying to say this one parklet is going to be in one spot. We're bringing activations like a mini golf course, a DJ. We're going to have tabletop parklet builds, yacht lawn games. Um, and you get to see all of the folks who also participated in the design competition, but their parklet didn't get to get built. So. All right, the yeah. sore losers won't be so sore. They'll be having a good time there. Parking day block party is happening Sunday, September 17th. It's at the Wilburn Street Tavern. That'll be so fun to see how it's reimagined and done. CivicDesignCenter.org. You can follow them on the gram as well. And we would follow you to learn what? 
how to make it beautiful outside. Yes? yes, so we can support local businesses who want to have a parklet in front of their space. We want to help them with the design and really make it possible for them to have more more patio space. I or love what they that. Need. You guys will be the gateway to a more beautiful place here in Middle exactly. Tennessee. So cool. <laughs> so follow them on the gram. We'll be back after the break.